Okay, Jose Mourinho has been appointed new manager at Wolves. I mean, probably one of the toughest jobs of his career. But first two games was a 9-1 win against Brighton and a 6-2 win against Villa. So yeah, I mean, that's that's not a bad start. Now we got 325 million to spend and we're going to finish the transfer window in this episode. Now, kind of like Mourinho at uh, Man United, what he thinks this team needs is a is a center back and a very, very solid one. Like, don't get me wrong, Bella Kochab is a very solid center back, but he's also very young. Jose thinks a new center back, an experienced center back in this team will really change this team up. It's just, we do have a lot of very, very good options here. So if you're enjoying the series, you want to see more of it, then drop a like, hit that sub button down below as well. And let's sign this man a defender. Okay, first comment, you should put a development plan on Rodriguez to boost his free kick stats because he only has 65 free kicks. Yeah, that is true. Even though he scored like maybe two or three free kicks, even with that low stat, the man's just got the CR7 gene in him. So if you put him on the complete striker plan, it'll make his free kicks go up. So we're going to put him on that. I think you should sign a world class center back that will be in the team for the rest of the save. 85 plus rated. Yeah, so we got a lot of money to spend. So it does make a lot of sense that we sign a really, really good player. But we got to remember FIFA's transfer budgets. I mean, whatever team you use, you usually have a big budget. We want to try and keep this like more realistic ish. But with Jose Mourinho, you got to imagine some bigger level players, some higher uh, tier players are looking to join Wolves maybe because of the special one himself. And last one, please change Guerrero to a left mid. He goes up to an 87. Yeah, I actually want to make him a center mid or a cam. And it's going to take 21 weeks to make him a center mid, which I don't think makes much sense. I mean, that's like four months. So if he plays good, it'll probably be less than that. Either this episode or the next one, he'll probably go into a center mid. I feel like he's going to be at least 86 rated, which is just, which is just nuts. So, so far in this window, we've signed Ronaldo Sanchez, Tanganga on permanent deals from their loan, uh, their loan deals and then we signed Guerrero for 22 million I think we got one more spot left on the team and it's gonna be a center back and you guys did suggest uh, some other very very good center backs we're gonna scout them and it's gonna be a very very tough decision here so while they're being scouted look at the Premier League table 15 goals scored in two games that might be the most over a two game span we've ever had in a series one would say a special start okay I'll stop but I mean Cavani's got three Sanchez has two Simons has two five assists for Simons two I just said two like six times it's great to see though that Rodriguez two and three while those center backs are being scouted we got Man United this time at Old Trafford another tough game once again we're those games actually us or was it just a fluke we're gonna find out now marcus edwards he's gonna have the season to try and prove to me that he's good enough but i feel like for some reason that 38 strength makes him feel horrible in game it feels like he's made out of paper so i think our nacho and also ronaldo jr are gonna get their chances and why not give ronaldo jr a chance to play against his father playing for manchester united son versus dad talk about the the storylines but two wins out of two let's see if we make that three wins out of three and then deadline day we're gonna send a center back a deadline day center back signing also of course how can i not mention this jose Mourinho back at old Trafford finished second he got fired like imagine that think how badly he wants to win this game back back at his old old team we're also wearing the away kits which I think are my favorite kits you guys like the kits which I am very glad to see oh we'll see what the boys can do I feel like it's gonna be uh gonna be an interesting one Sanchez get it off to us Sanche Sanchez we're gonna act like that uh that never happened Valentino to Ronaldo Jr wait for Dallo 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 against former team as well Oh, Ronald Jr. He's nervous because his father's on the field. Brought into Ronaldo Sanchez. So Sanchez this season is playing way more forward, which is proven to be a good thing. That ball was meant for Rodriguez, though. And that's a bad pass by, I think, Bruno Fernandez. Now, Rodriguez. Hey, what do we got here? Give it to Tomato. Into Rodriguez, Chavi. Now, Chavi's got a lot of pace, but we were in all the... Oh, I wasn't a play to Cristiano Jr. And Alfonso Davy. That's a very good signing for Man United. Oh, that's a good ball. Bella Kotchap. I think Tomato actually can't get over to cover it. And Bruno scores. And Alfonso Davies bombing down that wing. Just opened up all that space. And then Ronaldo played a beautiful pass. I guess Sanchez a little bit too far forward there. All right, 1-0 to United. That was a very good move. Marinho versus Ten Hag. Ten Hag uh, strikes first. Okay, Cavada, I need to see more strength than that. We just almost took out Anthony. Tomato into Sanchez. 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 Give it. Oh, that was going to be a shot for Xavi. These spaces are there for us. We're just not executing right now. Rodriguez off to Cavada. Cavada into Rodriguez. Whoa, again. It's supposed to go to Rodriguez. Why isn't it go to him? Bottom of Fernandez and wait for Ronaldo. Yeah, he is Ronaldo. Ronaldo, he's gonna shoot. Oh, that's such a bad re. That is such a bad rebound. How do we not get there first? Just everyone's asleep on that that rebound. Man, that once it got to Ronaldo, we were kind of screwed. But oh, someone's gotta be quicker to that. We just left Castile's out to dry, and that's the first half. Two 0 Not the return that Benigno wanted at Old Trafford. Now you can imagine the talk that Jose had with this team at halftime. We'll see if they respond. And Xavi gets that to Dallo. Dallo into Ronaldo Jr. Ronaldo Jr. Get it over to, okay, once again, that's supposed to go to Rodriguez. The game doesn't want me to get it to Rodriguez. They know he's so OP. Oh man, they are cutting us apart right now. Anthony, Anthony goes around Kilman and they're cutting us apart. 3-0. We are getting destroyed. Ronaldo scores against his son's team. I mean, the ball to Anthony. Anthony's dribbling here. Oh, those moves. We just got destroyed. 3-0. What am I seeing right now? Ronaldo Jr. Dink to Cavada. Good ball. Cavada 
into man rodriguez we're just we're just not up to it today although that's a very bad pass rodriguez 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 oh we're just too slow lamar good tackle by dallo okay get the ball out if we want to have the chance of getting a point in this game we gotta score now what about a chavi ronaldo jr oh man we, we just can't do anything this game this has been a very very poor performance all right this has been a reality check all five subs on okay that was a bit awkward oh man it's gonna fall somehow if they score fourth i'm gonna be mad castiles good save i mean this is a definition of a reality check first two games we did win by a lot but they were also against teams that uh i mean not top six teams we want to get there we got to beat these kind of teams this game we didn't do that at all i can't really name one player that played good at all rodriguez we have a chance for something no we don't okay three nil at old trafford but does not get his uh comeback that he wanted ruben neves is the captain of united our former player if the board had any reservations about signing a center back i think those are those are gone we need to sign a defender all right transfer to the end of the day let's go over these center backs now unfortunately they're not scouted but i think the ones that we're actually targeting are scouted so gonzalo Nacio, i think for the future he's definitely a target but he just went to robatiste so i think he's off off the table um kim min jay would be a very good option i think he looks really good and also i I feel like it's realistic ish then you guys suggested everyone below this so lucas hernandez would be amazing but he's at barcelona i can't see him going from barcelona to wolves especially at 28 years old like in his prime so we're gonna take him off but kanji has gone from man city to newcastle i feel like he would be good but once again he's just gone there like an asio so i feel like he might he's probably off the table and then there's tamori which would probably be the undisputed best option available i mean insane pace he got 95 jumping 89 strength he would be absolutely amazing and then abanez was a center back at roma for Mourinho, who's really good but he's made his way to real madrid so we're gonna take him off because once again he's already made his big move and then there's antonio rudiger who Mourinho tried to sign when he was at tottenham from chelsea i feel like he's 31 you know i don't know what center backs from should have but if they have someone better than him maybe it's time for him to move on for an 88 rated center back like 75 million is not that bad but i don't know how realistic that is i feel like that's definitely leaning towards uh more unrealistic and then tamori is obviously a very good player an insane player in fifa he'll be signed throughout the cycle so often but honestly the player that is speaking to me the most is is kim min jay i have never signed him before i've never used him he'd be much better than tanganga much better than uh bella Kocha, more experience at 20 seven years old and also Mourinho tried to sign him when he was at Tottenham too and I mean he spent a few seasons at Serie A you know scouting him kind of he's quick he's strong he's got very good defensive IQ stats he reminds me of like a like an aggressive version of Virgil van Dijk an even more aggressive version like the size quickness I mean maybe we can call him the Korean Virgil van Dijk I feel like Tamari is still is still a very big target for the series at some point later on but I feel like right now Kim and Jay makes the most sense I feel like it's the most realistic option so deadline day we're gonna offer 35 million and they accept that 35 million that's like that's like nothing compared to our budget and I think it's realistic so I think Think Kim Min Jae is joining uh, Wolves. So the way we're gonna work it is first choice, of course, Kilman, and then second choice, Kim Min Jae. Third choice is gonna be Bella Kochap, and then Tanganga is gonna be fourth choice, and also backup right back. That's what we're gonna do it. So everyone should get a good amount of game time. But I think if we want to qualify for the Champions League, player like Kim Min Jae, the Korean Virgil Van Dyke, I think. We need him. Jose Mirino needs him. And we have signed him up. Now, I know we could have signed like probably a high rate center back like Tamori Rudiger, but I feel like this one's more realistic. And once again, a player I've never used before, a player that I don't think is as popular as Tamori Rudiger and Karimo. Certain signings, you just feel it in your gut. That's signing that you need to make. And this one was exactly that. So welcome Kim Min Jae to Wolves. So he takes the number four shirt. And I believe he's gonna be he's gonna be very good for us. Uh, looks like he's drawing pretty well too, so it's good. Now I guess the way he's not like Richard Van Dyke is his dribbling, probably gonna need to get that up. But like the eye test, you got the size of Richard Van Dyke, he's got the pace, but 88 aggression, that's a, that's definitely more aggressive than Van Dyke. I would say so that's gonna be it for us transfer down the day that's all so we had four signings i think our team is good enough to qualify for the champions league but it's still gonna be a pretty tough challenge so top their biggest deal is valverde to spurs spurs that's a great signing martinez to leipzig and then chumini to uh, liverpool very very interesting all right so that loss sees us in fourth but still still a solid start now last season we got knocked out in the round of 16 of the europa league this season we're back in in our group is gonna be celtic michelin and sturm graz i feel like i'm saying that wrong but honestly that's group we should get uh should get through although i said that last year and it was also very very tough next game is gonna be leicester city though this game is going to be first sim game of the year 3-1 rodriguez Semedo, and rodriguez and now ronaldo jr i don't know why it took so long but we're gonna make him right winger because i want garnacho on the left and then junior on the right that's the way i want to work it i mean he's still 16 he's growing pretty well too all right so your league kicks off we got silva garnacho simons edwards Braganza, Caicedo, ramos kilman kimmin jay at center back and also tanganga right back so uh, a little bit of rotations we still should win this game though i feel like instead of signing like a very high profile player i want to sign kimmin jay and make him a high profile player kind of like how liverpool signed van dyke from southampton he became like the best center back in the world i want something similar why is there sunlight out it's it's the europa league all right kim and jay first touch gave the ball to him first touch for wolves welcome now let's win this game I feel like the games you never expect to be tough are usually tough so i just have a feeling about this game that we might uh, have a tough time because europa league is a little bit different costa makes a good save i mean costa is literally fighting for his life right now because castillos has proven to be so much better than him whoa that's a very bad clearance costa makes a good save what kind of clearance was that what did i say celtic on the ropes or we're on the ropes already good shot okay costa He's coming up big in this game already. I think that's uh, already three saves. Arnacho gets it to Fabio Silva. Silva laid off to Braganza. Okay, we did not lay it off to Braganza. Oh, that's such a bad mistake. Kim and Jay. 
Oh, that's such a bad mistake. I really just did that. I thought someone would be there. Jota, a Portuguese winger that's on our shortlist probably. Oh, that is such a bad mistake. There's no one to blame other than me. I should just clear it. Oh, I, I thought... That's such a bad pass. That's like the number one don't. Don't do as a center back. Pass it back like that. Okay, horrible start. Where is the team from last episode? Where are they at? Silva through to Edwards. That's a great ball. Edwards. Oh, man, great. That was a great ball by Silva. Hey, Celtic are not playing this game scared, although there's some space here for Caicedo. Caicedo. From distance, Caicedo. Oh, I thought that went in. That was such a good shot. Bro, Celtic are like pressing us so much. I'm not, I'm not, I wasn't ready for it. Although that's a great ball, Silva. Get that ball. Oh, Garnacho was so in there on the left. Here we got a free kick. Who's shooting this? Is it? It is Kim Min Jae. He's not shooting that. Get it to Edwards. Edwards. Oh, beautiful. Silva. Got to score that. Okay, that was a very good move right there. 1-1. One, one. Gabriel Silva is looking better this season. He's looking much better. Now, that's a very good move. Edwards. Good ball in. Perfect. I think that's another assist for uh, Simone's as well. All right, second half, 1-1. One, one. Come on, we played better after they scored. I want to see it continue. All right, Xavi, long ball to Garnacho. I like it. Garnacho. Laid up to Rodrigo Ramos, who you guys want to see play more. Ramos. Okay, that was a decent cross, actually. It's going to be bicycle kick cleared. Caicedo gives it to Edwards. Edwards. Distance finesse shot. That wasn't bad, Marcus. Silva, get it to Garnacho. Garnacho. Garnacho chance to score. Alejandro Garnacho gives us the lead. Beautiful goal from the former Man United youngster. Honestly, right now, I think in the in the ranking, I feel like he's number one. And then Edwards, number two. Ronaldo Drew, number three. Like, I think Garnacho might be my starting right winger in the in the first team right now. Very, very solid finesse shot finish. Okay, 2 1. Okay, Tete is kind of overpowered. Uh,. Rodrigo Ramos there. Oh, that's just, it's just such a good move. We got cut apart. Okay, Jota. Is that Jota? I think that's Jota, right? Yeah, the man is cutting us apart right now. Like, maybe we should sign him. I don't like it, but it is what it is. Yeah, Rodrigo Ramos is having a tough time over here with uh, Jota. A very tough time. All right, two subs coming on, though. Tommy Doyle on for Braganza. Hasn't played much, but he's still on the team, so still needs game time. And then Guerrero is on for Chavi. That should be easily cleared. Good clearance by Garnacha. Now, Caicedo, we got, we got space. Get, oh, just run. You got get on your bicycle, Caicedo. He's turning on the Jets. Caicedo, get the pass. Beautiful. Two. Edwards. Oh, how do we not score that? That that's gotta be a goal. That's so poor. Poor good defending. Kim and Jay. That's a very good tackle right there. Tommy Doyle. Tommy Doyle. Tommy Doyle. Oh, I went. I actually tried to actually finesse or fake shot that. And Ganga gives it to Caicedo. Doyle. Doyle. Good ball into Guerrero. Guerrero. Oh, we just got taken out. That's gonna be a free kick in a very good spot. Oh, it's also a double yellow. That's a red. See you later, Starfelt. Hey, who is taking this? I don't even know who's on the field. Who is taking this free kick? Um, okay, it's gotta be Guerrero. Guerrero's got 82 free kicks. Rafael Guerrero to maybe give us the lead. Our new signing from Juventus, Rafael Guerrero. Free kick. Oh, he sends it in the back of the net. What a free kick. This dude has been so good since signing him. He already has like three or four goals. And that's off the bench. 3-2. What a free kick. Rafael Guerrero. It's just from the not stratosphere. It's actually pretty close, but a good distance. Good curve. Beautiful. All right, 3-2. Can we hold this lead for 10 more minutes, please? Did they take Jota off? I feel like they took Jota off. He's supposed to be on the side, but he's not. Okay, Kilman, good tackle. All right, final subs. Rodriguez coming on. And also, um, uh, uh, Cristiano Jr. Finish the game, boys. Finish off this game. Okay, Jota's still on. I don't like to see that. That's a long shot. Block. And I think it was Kim and Jay, right? I think it was. Rodriguez, Guerrero. Can we just seal this win? Guerrero. Guerrero. What a good ball to Rodriguez. Okay, run, Garnacho. Run. Okay, play it over to Ronaldo Jr. Ronaldo Jr. Shot. Oh, that's not the shot I wanted. I wanted like a low driven shot to the corner. Look at Joyce. He's got bags under his eyes already. Corner lofted in to seal the game. Okay, Tanganga. I mean, he did what he killed with that, but that's that's full time. Guerrero free kick gets us a win on opening day. They look like twins right there. I still don't like us conceding goals like that, but it's it's a solid win at the end of the day. Still a W. All right, next game is West Ham in the Prem. This game is going to be another 3-1. Cavada, Rodriguez, and Rodriguez. Another brace for the, the star man of this club. And we got second team against uh, Morecambe in the FA Cup. Or, I mean, the Carabao Cup. And it's going to be 3-1. Garnacho, Silva, and Caicedo. Okay, our team is uh, liking the 3-1 wins right now. And Everton is going to be 4-0. Rodriguez, 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 and Xavi. Rodriguez hat trick. The man is amazing. He's got to be top scorer now, right? Uh, yep. Rodriguez top scorer by three goals. I mean, I'm not even surprised. Also, Chavi leading an assist too. I love to see that. All right, two more games to sim. First one is uh, SK Sturm. Another 3 1 win. Garnacho, Silva, and Garnacho. Garnacho playing great. And now Nottingham Forest. Okay, 2 1 loss away from home. That's uh, our, our second loss of the season. Tomato scored. But uh, that looks like it was a rough one. So after those games, we sit in second place. One point behind Man City. This has been the start that we wanted. We do have the worst defense out of the top seven but only by two goals so we're not crazy we've scored so many goals which is the good thing next game though is going to be liverpool i believe at home yeah at home i think a garnacho on the right kim min jay we have now the full back line with uh, tomato and dallow for the first time a true test we got the korean van dyke versus okay not van dyke where is van dyke oh yeah he's at spurs i forgot so they're playing who is beck beck araujo pavard and then trent it's a little bit weird it's been a good start for Mourinho to be in second place still 
We got to keep it up, though. It's a very, very long season. Liverpool are no pushover. All right, good ball to Florentino. We got Rodriguez. Oh, many chains. Just run. And that's not even to Rodriguez. I swear the game does not want me to pass to Rodriguez. They're trying to nerf him. I mean, wasn't going to work anyways. Off. Oh, that's actually... was that, I don't know who even just made that tackle. I can't even see. Rodriguez, Rodriguez. Oh, going all the way. How do you get that shot off still? I don't even know. It was a like good defending by Araujo, though. Florentino has been so good this year. I feel like he's really made a leap from last season. Javi gets it over to Garnacho, who's played so well in the second team, earned that starting spot. Florentino working around. Javi, Javi. Oh, man, that pass needs to be a little bit better. Still on, though. Still on. Into Chavi, shot by Chavi. Good, good move though. Corner in by Chavi Simons. Okay, Allison's gonna come out for that because he's such a good keeper. I love Allison so much. Nunez, Nunez, that's Kim Jay, right? Okay, I saw the pace right there from Kim Jay. Oh, then Kilman, a bad pass shot. Okay, Kilman made it up. That was a little, a little chill side foot block. I mean, I kind of like it, I kind of don't. Okay, that's a good ball. Too many. Oh, that just went by us. But Castiles, I mean, that shot was right at him. Okay, I think uh, Cavada just got hurt. I'm not even sure. He's on the ground. I don't think he is. Oh, no, what is this? Oh, I hate these. Why do they why do they start so deep? Now that's a great ball. Into Sanchez. Rodriguez. Rodriguez. Around Trent. Rodriguez early shot. Whoa, Rodriguez. I, we expect so much better from you. What was that? I mean, to be fair, his long shots are probably not, not exactly his thing. This has been an even game so far. Into Garnacho. Garnacho. Rodriguez is gonna pull the defenders. Garnacho. That was a bit of heavy touch. I mean, first half, not much happening. It's been pretty much as even as you expected. But we'll see what happens in the second half. I mean, Mourinho is known to play for the draw, so maybe we should do that a lot. He's really got the mentality that uh it's sometimes it's better to draw than lose. And like that outweighs going for the win. I feel like Klopp is like the anti of that. Now that's a great ball to Nunez. All oh, defense, Castiles. Good save though. Corner in. That is gonna be oh dangerous. I don't like that clearance. Castiles, what a save. Oh no, I think uh, who's hurt? So is Cavada hurt? Who is this? I think uh, Garnacho is hurt. I don't like that. But Ati, but Ati. Okay, that's a good tackle by Dallo. Rodriguez. Okay, uh, Cavada, can you run there? There, there. That's better. That's much better. Cavada. Cavada. Cut inside. Oh, he was offside. We were going to score that, too. This has been such a slow game compared to other games. Just so tight. No goals yet. Trent crossing. That's going to be unfortunate. But, hey, okay, Kilman. That is horrible. Castiles, good save, though. Hey, Castiles is keeping this game at nil-nil. Corner in. Dangerous again. Not the greatest clearance, but should be cleared twice. That is cleared twice. And Chevy wins that into Cavada. We got two. We got a two-on-one here. Two-on-one. Good ball, Rodriguez. This is his. This is Mr. Rodriguez. It's got to be him. Okay, breakaway. And just like that, this game is 1-0. That came out of absolutely nowhere, but I will take it. Who was running alongside uh, Rodriguez here? I don't even know who that is. I can't even see. I think it was uh, I think it was Dallow. Yeah, Dallow, you're not getting the ball in that spot. Maybe for a tap-in, I should have. But it is Rodriguez. That is a Jose Mourinho. Park the bus. Counter-attack goal right there. Tomato. Good tackle on Salah. Beautiful. Rodriguez. Ball out to Diogo Dallow now. Arnacho's making his run. That was a cut inside, though. Dallow. Dallow through the middle to Chavi. Oh, man, that thing had nothing on it, like no pace whatsoever. Good ball to Nunez. Oh, that's a great ball. Oh, I hesitated. Castiles saves us, though. I didn't know which center back to control of. Castiles absolutely saves us. All right, CR7 Jr. on for Cavada. Corner swung in. That's a great corner. Good clearance by Kim Min Jae, though. Parketh the Buseth. Nunez, Nunez. Okay, goes back. Salah. Oh, man, tough tackle. A, a great tackle by Garnacho, though. Come on, no mistakes. We got two minutes. Get this ball out, and this should be a win. Rodriguez over to Garnacho. Long ball to Ronaldo Jr. Header. Ball's up for him. Oh, how do we not score that? Is that a corner? Oh, we should be good. We should be good. Short corner. Renato Sanchez going to come out. Two. Renato Jr. shot. Oh, that's the worst outcome possible. Ref, blow the whistle. Oh, ref saves us. Thank you. Ref, you're getting your five bucks today. Okay, that game was that game was like a Jose Mourinho game. Like, so much defending, one counterattack. That's like our only goal. Really, our only very good solid chance. And it ends in a win. It's, that's a very good game right there. I mean, a little slow, but you know what I mean. Like, that right there was, a, without a doubt, a game we would have lost last season. Um, Europa League second team against uh, Michelin. This is going to be 3-2. Silva, Braganza, and Silva. And it is good to see Fabio Silva score. Okay, so we're still in second. Two points behind Spurs in first but we have a game at hand and also do man city who we play next i mean the tough games the tough games do not stop we're gonna go with the uh the third kid for this game which i think is uh very very nice so front three of foden holland and consolves that's a very good front three i think our nacho still keeps his starting you know edwards we'll give him a chance edwards will start him and i think still we go with that let's play rodrigo ramos because i know you guys want to see him play more he's pretty much like the the next uh jao Cancelo. so he's facing jao Cancelo. a good one against liverpool if we can do good against man city we can prove to everyone that we are the real deal this year this is what i call a tone setting game if we can win it but in this series man city have given us a few slappings so i don't like okay, we're gonna take an early shot cavada man our long shots look terrible this year we've got no mustard on our shots they're all plain okay sanchez we got runners here oh chavi was so in we need to get that ball through man city looking very open there that's surprising rodrigo ramos rodrigo ramos that was a bit shaky kind of just uh dribbled into trouble but then he makes a good tackle makes up for it beautiful our youth academy graduate although we got to send out some youth scouts we haven't done that this season oh that's such a bad ball too it's also a big game for uh you sir you know what edwards edwards 
Rodriguez is just pulling those defenders everywhere because of how much a threat he is. Good save by Ederson, though. Cross in. That's a beautiful... Oh, that's going to be something. Okay, I, I fake shot at it. Dallo. Dallo. Cross in. So many people there, but it's Rodriguez. What a cross by Dallo Rodriguez. Of course, he scores. I mean, Dallo was patient here. No one closed him down. He had so much time to pick out that cross. And then Rodriguez. He's the only like pink shirt there, and he still wins it. Okay. 11 goals in nine games this season. Rodriguez is insane. 1-0 to Wolverhampton Wanderers. Kyle Walker into Gonzalez. I'm looking for Holland. I'm looking for Holland. Killman. 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 Captain. Strong defending. Edwards gets it through to Dallo. Dallo. We time it to Rodriguez. Oh, man. That was very well defended, Ruben Diaz. Now, that's an interesting pass back to Ederson. Okay. Ederson's good with his feet, so I'm not even surprised. Florentino. Strong challenge. Now, Chavi. Chavi Rodriguez. Go for the counter attack. Rodriguez is getting that. He's getting that. He's getting that. I see it. Oh, never mind. I did not see it. Kim J versus Holland. What is he going to do? Kim J versus Holland. Gets it through. Foden. Foden. Don't let the pass get through. Okay, we smothered him there. But it's going to be a penalty given up by, I think, Renato Sanchez or Kim J. Who is it? Who is it given up on? It was Kim J. He actually... Wait, what? Oh, wait. Oh, we kind of took him out from behind. Oh, our new signing. That What was that? Like, from behind? That was such a weird play. Holland. Penalty kick is in the back of the net. Okay, 1-1. One, one. That is uh, that is truly, truly unfortunate. The game is tied up. You guys into Chavi. Chavi, get it out. Beautiful pass to Edwards. Edwards, he's got no support though. Dallo, overlap. He's not overlapping, but there he is. Got no options. Where's the options in the box? Dallo, cross in too close to Ederson. We just uh, we just took him out. And then Cavada just got hurt. I think he just got elbowed in the face. Yeah, Cavada is hurt now. Okay, hopefully he walks it off. Get him some icy hot. Florentino, great steal. Edwards up to Rodriguez. Rodriguez, this is a two-man game that we should get a chance from. Rodriguez down the middle. Oh, that pass was overhit a little bit. Man, see, are defending those passes so well. Now, that's a through ball to Holland, which is insane. And... Oh, like what a finish by Holland. That is nuts. We can't do much about that. It's 2-1 to Man City. That was just dirty. It doesn't even show it, but all oh, the, oh, the bicycle kick. Like, what is that? We can't do much about that. That is amazing from Holland. Okay, 2-1. The tip of your hat and you try to tell the game up now. Okay, Kavada is still hurt. I don't like to see that, but Xavi's in. Xavi, Simons is in. Xavi, oh, a possible angle, and he sneaks it through. What a finish by Xavi. That was like an impossible angle. It's a very good through ball, but I think uh, the injured Cavada and it's such a tight angle. We probably don't expect him to shoot, but he does, and it's in the back of the net. Look at that angle. Low driven shot. Oh, it got Ederson caught so much on surprise there. Okay, Cavada still hurt, so we're going to bring on we're gonna bring on Garnacho for Cavada. Hopefully, he's not hurt too bad, because that would be one of the worst injuries we can get. Sanchez, good steal. Rodriguez. Gets it to Chavi. Chavi, hold the ball up. Hold the ball up. Get it to Dallo. Now, Dallo has a lot of options here. Can he get by this defender? I think he can. We're going to cross it in. Great cross, but also very well defended. Chavi, I don't know what that was. Into Sanchez. Chavi, get up. You could probably score. Into Chavi. Chavi, lay it off too. Oh, Garnacho. Oh, that was a good shot. It's just a little bit wide. I kind of want Rodriguez in that spot. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Rodriguez. Oh, Ederson, what are you doing? What did I say? He's good with the speed. I never mind. All oh, because of that. Okay, well, Rodriguez, I'll allow it. Oh, Ederson, that is a horrible mistake. Rodriguez catches him. Look at him. Oh, he knew it. He knew it. He read it. Rodriguez, he's got the IQ level too. 3-2 in the 71st minute. Oh, no. Kim Min Jae. One-on-one -on -one defending. Kim Min Jae. Oh, man, that was solid. Oh, that's solid defending right there from our new signing. Rodriguez, good ball out to Edwards. Edwards into Rodriguez. Rodriguez, get it back to Chavi. Chavi. Chavi holds it. No, he does not. Florentino on De Jong. Okay, we got to try and stop him here. De Jong, we're going to go for the tackle. Oh, we stopped on a dime there. Florentino, good tackle though. We got eight minutes. Sanchez, Sanchez, what are you doing? Okay, play it. Sanchez, I pressed pass. He didn't play it. There you go. Get it back, Sanchez. Garnacho, good turn. Chavi down the middle. Chavi down the middle. Actually, Rodriguez. 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 Oh, that's a foul. That's going to be a free kick, I think. Oh, it's Mr. Rodriguez to seal the win, maybe. The next Ronaldo. Look at him. He is the next CR7. He's going to score this to seal the game. Damn it. Okay, we're getting full subs on. Come on. We got to seal this game, though. We got four minutes. Good tackle. Oh, wait. That's not a foul. Wait, what? Bro, this is rigged. That was, I barely touched Holland. Oh, no. Free kick. Get it out. Oh. Oh, I thought that went in. I thought that went in. I was about to... Like, delete this game. They get a freak. It got a nothing. And Dion goes for a bicey. And it's... Okay, it looked much better from our angle. Oh, my. Get the ball out. Castiles. Who fit forward? We have a chance here, maybe? We have a chance. Okay, Silva. Silva. Third to Chavi. Oh, that should have been a chance. Okay, they got... Oh, man. They actually have time. Dion. Oh, Florentino. Good tackle. Oh, we just got around him. Kick it. Okay, there we go. 
Man, what a win. That was so hardly fought. 3-2 at the Etihad. We win. Jose Mourinho is proving that Wolves are the real deal. Before it was Barcelona, Real Madrid, Pep versus uh, Mourinho. Now it's Wolves v Man City. Rodriguez, another brace. Man, what? What a win. Still should have scored that free kick, though. Okay, Cavada is going to be hurt, and he's going to be out for four weeks. That's, uh, I mean, it's, it could be worse. Could also be much better. So while he is out, definitely Edwards is going to get a, a much more chance to play. So Edwards in for Cavada. And then Garnacho to the left. Nine games in. Seven wins, two losses. You can't lie. Hey, we are the real deal this year, I think. At least for, like, challenging top four. And that is because of Jose. All right, second team, uh, Brentford, Carabao Cup. I'm a little scared of uh, Brentford. And this game's still 2-1, though. Garnacho and Braganza. And Garnacho, he's been playing so well. If we go for a little setup, then I feel like Garnacho is probably towards uh, the top. Yeah, he's third highest goal scorer with five. Rodriguez, 12-5. and five. Silva, 6-9. and nine. As a backup striker, he's playing so good. Gabby, 4-7. and seven. Cavada, 4-3. and three. I need to see more from Ronaldo Jr. He's only got one goal in 11 games. And also, where is Edwards? Edwards, uh, no goals in seven games. It's uh, it's a bit worrying a little bit. Here we got Burnley, 1-0. Rodriguez got two yellows and he got sent off, but Dallow scored the winner, I guess. That's on, that's a weird one. I mean, Europa League, we are looking good so far. Three games, three wins. Much better than last year. And okay, Fabio Silva, hat trick against Michelin. Three goals for him. Bro, that loan move last year has definitely helped out his career a lot. All right, two more games. Rodriguez spent it for this one. It's going to be Southampton. That's a tuna win. Ronaldo Jr. scores and also Silva. Good to see little Ronnie scoring. All right, just like that, Cavada is back. Beautiful. So Garnacho is playing for Argentina. Sanchez, Tomato, Dallow for Portugal, and then Castillo's Edwards and Kilman also called up. Marcus Edwards called up for England. That's uh, that's pretty cool. Okay, Bournemouth, 3-2. Rodriguez scores, uh, Chavi scores, but that's going to be our third loss of the year. Is that the legend Alexis Vega? Finally, Guerrero into a center mid. He's going to go up to a 87? Okay, I thought like 86, but I, he's actually 87. That's that's actually insane. We bought him for 22 minutes. What is value now? His value is now 65 million. That is, that is nuts. All right, so Celtic, match day four. So if we win this, it pretty much guarantees. It might, might be already guaranteed guaranteed actually uh yeah okay it's already guaranteed we're in first they've played terrible so actually we're gonna sim this Celtic I was gonna play you guys I am disappointed in you 2-1 though so okay two goals from Fabio Silva I gotta say Fabio Silva is is quietly catching up to Rodriguez 12 goals in 10 games for him nine in the Europa League that's actually very surprising all right next game is the Crystal Palace we got some rotations here because the next game the next game is big this one's gonna be 2-2 Ronaldo Jr. and Kilman score so now 13 games into the season we sit in second place with a game in hand next game is against Spurs Jose facing his former team again. Okay, our defense is looking much better. Defense is actually better than Man City's. I like to see that. But okay, Wolves v Spurs. I need to see something from Edwards because I'm honestly questioning his future right now. Just like my United, you know Jose wants to win this game very badly. We definitely look like a new team this year. We've taken that leap. It's just we're so young. Consistency is going to be going to be a question mark. Okay, Kim and Jay, that is an extremely good tackle. I like to see that. Rodriguez waiting for Cavada. Cavada. Beautiful. Cavada gets around the defender. Beautiful. Cavada. Chip shot. Oh, it's going to go slightly over the net. I want him to do like a little chip. Okay, Kim and Jay, another good. No, wait, that was a clean tackle. What was that? How is that a foul? I don't get these refs. Thankfully, that's cleared. Now we can go on a break, though. All right, Ramos, good tackle. Ramos, we got Cavada. Timed right. Cavada is kind of, kind of wide here, though. We got Rodriguez. Rodriguez, you're making a terrible run. We're going to pass it into you, though. Okay, it's going to be a corner. Rodriguez, I need you to go to like the penalty spot there. I'm feeling a goal from this corner. I'm feeling it, Mr. Krabs. I'm feeling it. That's a lot of bodies in the way. Wait, it's going to happen. Oh, it's going to happen. I spoke it into existence. It is Captain Kilman with the goal. 1-0 to Wolves. What a weird corner goal. It's like uh, deflected by, I think, maybe a Spurs player. Falls for Kilman and good technique. All right, that one was a bit odd. Oh, Kim and Jay on his uh, national team teammate. Good tackle. He's looking better game by game, Kim and Jay. Renato Sanchez. Man, that, that thing had some power on it, but not the placement to that pass. All right, Kim and Jay on Kane. Oh, man, that's such a good ball. But Dallow, Dallow, strength. Strength on Mr. Sir Harold. Okay, we just took Kane out. Okay, I don't like this. I don't like this. Kim and Jay all in for the tackle. Mistake. Kilman, though, good positioning. That was very desperate. Now, that is a great ball. Valverde, who is a great signing. Oh, man. Someone's okay. Someone's got a mark. Thankfully, Castiles makes the save. I didn't know who to control there. Corner sent in. Out, out, out by Dallo. Good clearance. Right back into uh, Sun, though. And this is looking actually pretty good. That's a weird shot. Kane, header. Castiles will grab it. Renato Sanchez. We got Xavi down the middle. Good timing on that pass, Xavi. Oh, man. That's not what I wanted. It works, though. Edwards. Into Rodriguez. It works. Rodriguez. 2-0 to Wolverhampton. Wanderers. Edwards. That was a decent pass. I mean, whenever you face Spurs, Rodriguez will score. It's guaranteed now. But uh, into Rodriguez. Rodriguez. Oh, man. He was not He was like jogging there. Don't injure my star player. Oh, man. This is risky. Risky. Okay. Nope. It's not risky because it looks good. Nevada. Long ball. Beautiful to Dallo. Dallo. Good first touch. Oh, man. The pass was absolutely horrendous, though. Sessegnon. Oh, Rodrigo Ramos. What a tackle. It has fathered him. Now, Rodriguez. Oh, he's on his moped. Look at him. He's on. He's on his bike. Oh, Rodriguez. Beautiful. Rodriguez. Chip is so disappointing. I thought we were going to score like Holland in that uh, last game. Gabby, long shot. Why not? That's not a long shot, but 
It was uh, an on target, on target shot. Here's gonna be a long shot. Okay, no, it's not. He's okay. What a tackle by Conrad Limer. I'm not convinced by Edwards. He's 85 rated, but it does not feel like it at all. Him and Jay get stuck in. Oh, Sun just destroyed his uh, his teammate now. Kane, Kane. Okay, good, good positioning there. Sanchez. Oh, we can't let them all get through. That was not good defending. Lacelso is back at Spurs. Was he on loan at? What team is he on loan at? Villarreal? All right, 2-1. They got, they got one to go back. We got 15 minutes to hold this lead. Oh, man. Am I feeling like a crumble like last season's Wolves team would have done? I'm kind of feeling it. Castile's good save. That's a very, very good. Castile's has been so much better than Costa. All right, Kim Min, Jay, let's just... That's not... I, I put some power on that, and that's all I got from it. That's so disappointing. All right, we're going to put Fabio Silva up top and Rodriguez on the right. That is something we could try. Like, Rodriguez is a winger and Silva at, up top at striker. We're going to go with that, though. The changes. Now, three minutes. And they got a free kick in a good spot. Oh, we do. Never mind. Thank you, ref. Son. Okay, I think uh, that was a good tackle by Kilman. Rodrigo Ramos. That is uh, not enough strength shown by him. They got one final chance to cross it in, maybe. That's all. Oh, no, that's a good ball. Get it out. Oh, that's such a weird, it's such a weird shot. That's gonna be it though. Okay, we've beat Man City, Liverpool, and now Tottenham, but they were very, very close. They were not convincing wins at all. The good thing is they don't have to be. We're in the top six. These games should be close if we're making this leap, and we just beat those three teams. It's a statement episode by this Wolves Club and by Jose Mourinho. All right, so we got January transfer window in the next episode. The budget is still 289 million, and one player I'm not convinced by is Marcus Edwards. I mean, he's got no, he's got no goals in 13 games, four assists, which is not bad, but no goals. Does he need replacing in January? I mean, one player who played so against us is Jota from Celtic. I don't know what his rating is, but he could be a solid replacement. I don't know. I feel like that's the one big player that I'm thinking about in January that could possibly leave. You guys, let me know what you think about that, though. As we end the episode in first, tied with Man City. I mean, we're showing that we're the real deal, led by our, our new manager. So if you enjoyed, drop a like, hit that sub button down below as well. We're chasing 110,000 subs. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. As always, hope you have a great day.